this video captures some audio that was really good because a friend of mine came over and she's been having some ghost problems with her dead grandmother in the house and just recently had somebody that was like her dad invite her to go out and then he died because he wrecked his car and flew through the windshield and for the purposes of you got to know that you're not able to go back or be the fault of things like that is the reason to listen up i was very upset about it for many a weeks so i was being fucked and i needed my pay yo And actually, I think I get paid next week, too, because that's when I'm supposed to be paid. And that's cool. Why? Well, it's cool because they gave me both halves of my check. They gave me the half my ex-wife was supposed to get. So I got a lot of money, which I needed. It's not like really a lot when you're supposed to have some saved and all that other shit. But that's okay. Dream. I do. It's very. Oh, I'm not hearing nothing. Can't see. What can I do? What can I do with nothing with this? Did this guy already do it before I got here? You fucking bastard. She's chasing around all last night. And Man, it was weird. I'll tell you what, it was fucking weird. Because it was like being in a wraparound apartment. And there was something like you could I having to jump down into like off a of fire down into like a blackness because it led to wherever I needed to go. And it was it was felt really real. Like it was really something to be worried about if I was to fall or somehow land in the abyss. But I made it. it was like just a small amount of trouble. Who in the fuck is shooting me? That's not going to work. Okay? Here's why. I'll blow your motherfucking ass away, you son of a bitch. That's how I feel. Real fucking extra aggressive today. Not really... I guess we're not needing this. Somebody's already killed his ass. Don't fucking shoot me no more. Prick. Then we ended up on some sort of train. The train was gigantic. It was very wide. Like, I've never even imagined a train being like 30 feet wide. But it was. And on it, each of the sections were classrooms. And, and... Partly apartment building homes. As I wound through it, I was trying to find a place to. I think sleep with someone. Yeah, I'm. I'm afraid it's that. I'm afraid that's what it was. Now, see, I already had the preemptive. I have things appear in my dreams, and I'm not exactly sure why I then see them the next day real fast but there's a, sh a show i think it's parks and it's like a it's like the office but it's like with another one and there's a girl named april a mean little dark-haired girl which i find very attractive she made her way into the dream and when i saw her on the um youtube videos i was like oh that's the girl how bizarre and I guess it was bizarre. Oh well, who gives a shit? So, 
when I headed towards the front of the train, it was like another bunch of desks facing, like you have the, the desks for kids facing towards like the teacher's area, you know? Well, this had the teacher's area with the desk with a bunch of student desks and all the teachers were sitting in it. And when I, when I ran in there, it was like if, if you ran into somewhere you weren't supposed to be. <clears throat> and I was smoking a cigarette, which I don't smoke anymore. And I remember thinking, why am I smoking this? But I tasted it, and it tasted like shit. And I was like, Man, I must really fucking put it up for something. I don't want to smoke. I don't, don't want to smoke. I don't crave it. Nicotine, I do. So if in a scenario, I will smoke a cigarette for the nicotine. But I don't. I don't want to have anything to do with cigarettes. I feel like that's a major victory in my life. And it might be like we got somebody. Hell, I'm playing the game now. I th think my dad can get it. If you're up, will you get it? Probably in the bathroom. Motherfuck. Running for my life. Hi. I'm doing all right. I'm running for my life and shooting people. Pow, pow, pow. Oh. <laughs> I just noticed the lady at the bank, she's a good Christian woman, we talk all the time. She put a smiley face on my bank. Now that is where I get triggered again. Because for whatever reason, there is a mind control angle where the <laughs> mind controlled believing themselves Christian women are basically nonstop attacking me. They're not aware of it except the ones that are aware of it. And, you know, when somebody believes their self to be in the possession of the right standing of religion, there's nearly any, nothing you can do to withstand it. But if you yourself have work to do, you'll just clear it out and you'll come to the right understandings. So that's usually where I start to distance myself again because I don't trust it. Oh, that she, <laughs> like, she must like you. She does. She's sweet. Uh, nobody's shooting at me. <laughs> I got a real bad carpal tunnel, and I like to play this in the morning to see if oh my god. hands work. Oh, my God. I have the same thing. Mine have been going real bad at night. Like, I'm like, I had no, a real time. I don't understand. Like, look. I don't know if you can see. Okay, it's not that swollen today. Yeah, look, these are ganglion cysts, and they're knots, and they swell up. Oh, so not shit. only do I have the carpal tunnel, but then I have this. I don't have none of that. I don't know what's it's, my it's, mind's it's, doing it. Look, okay, I notice I can't lay my hand very flat. It's because, why? Because I'm always holding cups? Maybe. Lighters? Maybe. I mean, I think about, what do I do with my hand, my right hand mostly? It's usually open, closed. I know what you don't do. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> shit. Anyways, you know what I'm saying? My whole hand is affected is what I mean. Because mine, I'm constantly using it. Oh, I, right. I don't know why mine's like that. They told me. I think it's from overuse, especially because I was a teacher for 30 years. You know, at preschool, you got to move your hands every single day. You know what I mean? Constantly. I was just telling the. Oh, I'm recording this too. Fuck. Um, well, I better hide out in the barn. Get in the barn and hide out. <laughs> I had this dream about being on this. Show. Are you already? Yeah, it's right Sir, there. Thank you. Oh. Wait, you know what? Do you have... Wait, let me think. No, I gotta get groceries and stuff. I was like, I want more, but I better not. We're, we're about to go. I finally got all my money, and I can... Yeah, find I the first time I haven't had my credit debit card since messed I up. went to the beach. But the, it got demagnetized, so I've had no access to any money. For the last month, they've halved my check every time. And and gave me some dumbass reason. To, oh. This is the week that I'm not supposed to get paid, but I got paid $500. Because they had to pay me... When they pay me, they give me her money. Mm -hmm. They just, I don't know why, and there's nothing I can do about it. And I ain't going to complain and bitch. Right. But in my dream, she was chasing me, trying to kill me. Oh, my gosh. 
there, there's something weird about what's going on. Have you been having weird dreams too? Yeah. And you know what? With my friend Bill that died in that car accident. They, um, they, um, I, I had, it was, by the way, he was drunk. He was drinking from one to 10 PM. See, that's not your fault. And he had asked me to go, but I said, no, he doesn't even drink, but he was so sad about his wife dying. Well, you so know, lost. And so that's what happened. He hit a curve, hit a tree and he was, he, he just flew out of the car. He didn't even have a seat belt on. That's not like him. I mean, this is not like him at all. You know, he does not do these things. So we were just devastated, devastated. Sometimes, and sometimes somebody wants to be with the person so bad I that I think you're right. subconsciously that they I end think up. You're right. You know. I do because we could see signs before that he was just a lost puppy. They were married thirty years. Man, I've been watching them, and I shouldn't, but every once in a while I turn my TV on and I watch for this the synchronization of what's on there. Yeah. They they were talking about, and I saw the the girl being interrogated. The girl killed this guy. And they had put it, framed it in such a way they're like, not only does this woman just not go and talk to you, that she's actively pursuing killing you. I'm like, well, damn, that's fucked up. And then it, there was some signs of things that I'd seen that would lead that way. It'd be like, you know, hopefully you die and then I will get some money somehow. I'm like, oh, fuck. Well, see, here's the last thing that happened with him. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> see, we'd also talked about car wrecks and things like that before this. We both had like a fear of it um the other thing too is i for some reason i would not drive with him now he has a car with no ac so that's of course a lot of it that's a simple enough not because i'm you know snobby but with all these bumps on my head and stuff i just can't handle the heat but anyway so Dude, I didn't, it is, when we went to the beach at home and I, i'm gonna call my brother i stayed longer by myself and he went home then there was one time he came to my house he wanted me to go with him to get barbecue and i said no i'm gonna stay here i never wanted to ride with him and i didn't know why well, you know that's and it, it was a subconscious thing, and and you gotta learn to read that shit. I Did do. You, but, I listened to my gut, and guess what else? I had a premonition about his, the accident. Like before, I found out actually what happened. I dreamed about what happened. I dreamed he had no seatbelt on. I dreamed he was alone in the accident. I dreamed he hit something. I saw the expression on his face when when he was about to make impact. I mean, it's really been affecting me hardcore. I've seen that on the ghost. Um, Seriously, like I I feel like I really saw it happen. I saw a ghost. On 71 going towards um, Columbus or going towards Houston yeah. in the nighttime. And it fully materialized. It was like a guy on a 1950s shake. guy on a 1950s bicycle. And he turned his head with that look of horror. And I'm like, that's got to be how it died. Oh. And that's crazy because, you know, it was like it wasn't a person. And it, then it dematerialized. And then I saw another one. Oh, oh, we, oh go ahead. Um, down 1441 and there's a very small bridge and I saw a, like a like a weird phantom uh, carriage across there and then it just like while it was on the bridge you could see it and then it vanished I was like what the fuck is that now I haven't seen in real life but I've seen on these shows and videos where they show all these crazy stuff that recorded and I've seen similar type things I've got other Never guys now it, it's but I've, I've already spoken with it and told it look motherfucker yeah i don't no. care it's fine you could be a poltergeist but you're gonna get the fuck out of my room yeah don't mess with me you're not gonna be in I my space and then right. i, I right. left out of there and i heard <laughs> like something slamming in there and i go in there and i don't see nothing's moved around listen to this same thing I'm like what me. the hell is that <laughs> grandma she's been messing with me all right she's been making noise because you're gonna sell her house <laughs> and, uh, so the other day i got tired of it see i've been getting mad at her because uh the did family's... she think you were gonna live there or something what was what's no, really no, she knows the plan that we sell the house and we all force flare share the profits that was my grandpa jim's wish to take care of the grandkids instead of just me having the house which is fine but anyway, I keep hearing these noises, Kelly. There's there's never been noises from her room. There's no reason for any noises in there. You know what I'm saying? And it keeps happening. Well, yesterday I got mad at her. And I've been mad at her because she was mean to me and stuff, too. And I still had to forgive her for that. But I was mad. And I said, quit harassing me. Leave me alone. <laughs> and there hasn't been any more noises. I still think it's a... Um, and well. But I did. I told her, quit. I don't like this. Stop. I mean, I was serious. And I believe it worked. And I really know she's in that house. But she's fucking with me. I don't think it's her. You don't? No, I think, I think, well, I said, well, I remember when it, after it happened, I told you, I said, there's going to be, there's going to be that, no, there's going to be that period of time where she's going to be going to the light and doing her thing, but you're going to have house spirits that are going to mimic her. And, oh. and it's not, See, it's maybe not, I didn't quite understand you saying that. I, I knew you didn't. And I, I 
I knew what I was talking about, but then I learned more about it later on after See, exactly. The fact. I, I, now I can understand and accept what you're saying. Because it was like, I that's why I didn't, that's it. why I didn't no more because but i knew yeah because i've experienced it i've been looking into some of that shit and part of part of it doesn't make no sense to me why would somebody be uh able to harass somebody or haunt them right well i understand now how it works i do too are you trying motherfucker i got oh he blew me up and i don't feel meanness from her i just feel like she's trying to just pick on me tease me like she used to always do yeah well that that'd be that'd be like the yeah those those things she always did Let's do that. She too. put me up. I was emotionally abused my whole life. Yeah, my mom. One day she's so proud of me. The next day I'm a piece of shit. Yeah, I don't know why people are. So that's something I'm having to deal with too through this death. You know, forgiveness, not not be angry, let it go. She can't hurt me anymore. <laughs> I did my job. Just mean, like snappy yeah, mean. Yeah, mean, 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 mean. <clears throat> so anywho, enough about that. All right, I'm pet sitting. I got four dogs at the house. Got to get back. You guys have a good day.